Music on the Bricks returns to downtown North Platte. And joining me now is George Lobby. Thank you so much for joining me. Thanks for having me. Uh, of course. Appreciate like we were mentioning, um, people are just waiting to enjoy the outdoors. And yes. what a perfect event. Uh, springtime, we have, what, 10 days or 12 days of wet weather, basically. Sun's out right now. It feels great. And it looks like the forecast looks good for Saturday. I think they're talking 75 and no chance of rain and sunshiny. So perfect weather. That would be perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what do you got going on this year for this? Well, um, we got three bands this year, and um, we're starting about six o'clock, like we we normally start, and um, it's just on Saturday night. Um, but we'll go to about midnight. We got the three bands are bases loaded, and Steve Main is the leader, uh, um, the drummer, and uh, he grew up in North Platte, and uh, they're a really top-notch dance band. They do all kinds of music, three-part harmonies. They're really tight. They're really accomplished. They've been. Steve's been playing for 30, 30 plus years, maybe 40, kind of, who wants to count that far, but that's how, that's how good and how polished they are. They played quite a bit in North Platte off and on over the last few years, so I think people are aware of them. And if you haven't heard them, come out, because it's a great chance to kick up your heels and enjoy some great music. Um, before that, um, Kenny O'Dean's band, a lot of people know Kenny from Hershey, and he's got a really good band. They play kind of like um, Steely Dan, that kind of stuff, like the gems of the classic rock era. And they're going to play for an hour from uh, 6 to 7. Um, Bases Low is going to be from 7 to 10. And then from 10 to midnight is Jack Bunger, and a fabulous guitar player, with the pros. So Jack's like 21 or 22, and the pros are uh, in their 60s. Oh, wow. and, uh, but they, they're, there's a, they're the best rock trio around. Uh, they're really great. Perfect. Really so great. tickets are five dollars, and there's going to be just five food. bucks. Yeah, we made a promise to everybody and to ourselves that we'll keep it at five bucks one more time at least. So okay. we want to make a family night. So we got kids games. I think there's 20 some vendors that are going to be there. Oh, wow. And I uh, was just talking about the kids games this morning. We're getting all set up. We'll have hula hoops and bubble machines and a little soccer kick area for the toddlers and stuff. And we'll have a good time. And there, we're Planet has some adults supervising. You will probably want to keep an eye on your own kids, but you can leave them for a while and go relax a little bit. And uh, it's just off the intersection, so you can have a beer in the intersection. You can have a sandwich out there. You can hear the music up the street. You can keep an eye on your kids and you can talk to friends. Perfect. That's the kind of atmosphere we want to have. Yeah. So Great. it's coming um, together good. Good. One last question: do, do people need to bring lawn chairs? Do you recommend they do. that? Do yeah, bring a lawn chair. Okay. And, uh, We'll have refreshments and food. It'll all be there. Good Life on the Bricks will have their food and refreshments, and uh, they'll be out on the street. Uh, Rowdy Rot Barbecue will be there, and we got a hot dog vendor. Uh, oh, wow. Chicago, okay. authentic Chicago hot dogs. Oh, okay. Yeah. Awesome. So, yeah, we're looking forward to it. All right, perfect. So this Saturday from 6 to midnight, right. $5. Right, $5. All right, thank you so much, well, come George. Come on down. Will do. Okay. And uh, here's what's happening on Wall Street.